Alright guys, this is Luigi Rocks 2014 doing uh, part 2 of Super Mario 3D Land. In this video, we're going to be heading to World 2. As you can see, I actually rounded up a few extra lives. I went back to World 1, uh, 2 to get some more 1-ups, and that's pretty much what I did. And that's pretty much how I ended up with 638 lives at the end. Alright, so let's see. Fire flower, don't really want that. Uh, so let's see. We want to come up here. And then over here, we want to go into this pipe. Which over here lies the next star coin. Oh, whoops. I want to get down that pipe. Uh, wait. Alright, so there's one up right there, and then another one over there. And that puts us at 640 lives. Oh my gosh, whatever. Oh, star coin. Crap, I need to get over there. Uh, if I can, that is. Alright. Come on, get up there, Mario. Jeez. Alright, over here, grab another Tanuki if you lost the one you had before. Alright, and then over here, just long jump your way across if, you, if you're like me where you really don't need the Tanuki suit. And how the hell did I... Oh my gosh, are you fucking serious? Fuck this. Man, this game, like, seriously. Alright, whatever. No golden flagpole for that, so I'll just... I'll just get that off camera when I go back and do this later on. Whatever, I'm not going back. Yeah, so, I'm not gonna get that golden flagpole because I really don't feel like wasting time doing so. So, forget it. I'll get that later if I really have to. I mean, I, I know I have to get the golden flagpole in order to beat this game 100% and all, but, yeah, I'll just do that off camera. It, getting the golden flagpoles is really simple, really. I, I, I shouldn't, I really shouldn't even have to show you guys on screen on how to get them. I mean, I'm sure you guys get the idea on how it works. Alright, over here, you have the second star coin and the another clock to buy up some time. Actually, I'm just going to... Flip that. Okay, crap. Grab another timer, and then... Oh, crap. Head, head into the pipe. Alright, so grab a few coins, and then... And then over here, hit this switch, and then make another platform appear. And there we go. So that's World 1 2. Or 2 2, I should say. Alright. So we're going by these levels pretty fast. And the next up, we have a mystery box to head to. Alright, so grab your star medal. Okay, so after that, then we have the next level. And yay, it's a retro level of uh, Mario Bros. 1. And yeah, I really do like the music on this one. The music's actually pretty good. Alright, hit that, and then I'll... Alright, so there you go. 
There's some coins right there, and then more coins over here. Actually, other oh, okay. There is one little secret I want to show you real quick. That's actually near the beginning. All right, hit this switch, and then make your way up here. All right, over here you got the first star medal. All right. And there you go. I don't definitely want that timer. And then. We're, we're getting like tons and tons of one ups. Oh crap. Okay. Thought we were going to die there. But we didn't. Alright. What? Well, that's just a bunch of coins. We, we don't really need to hit that. Crap. Yeah. Don't really need those coins, so forget that. I do like the music on this. The music here is pretty good. Alright, so hit that. Alright, over here you got your final star coin. Just do that and then. Alright. Alright, I might have missed a few coins, but hey, that's fine. I think that I might be able to get enough. There's like tons and tons of coins. Now look at all that. Get grab all those coins. Alright. Make your way in here. Now before we grab the flagpole, hold on. Over here... You actually got a one-up over here. Haha, -ha, but you didn't know that existed. Alright, awesome. So that's World 2-3. Really awesome level right there. I actually do like how when you beat the level, it ends off with the classic uh, fireworks music thingy at the end of Super Mario Bros. 1, the level clear theme song. Uh, nah, maybe later. Yeah, it's just telling me to take a break and all that. Now, nah, I'll, I'll take a break when I want to take a break. Since I have so much memory on my camera, I just want to keep recording as far as I can. Since these worlds are, like, really short, I just want to try to get through them as quickly as possible. Alright, so, let's see. Over here we have... Oh my gosh, All right, oh, we're, we're back and this is like the second attempt now of trying to, of me trying to get the second star coin, which of course I keep dying. Oh man, this part's like going to be really tricky for me considering the fact that it's hard to see where I'm going. Oh man. Um, so the only... Man, I, I'm just getting really sick and tired of dying, like... Seriously, every Mario game, I always end up dying on the first world. It's so retarded. Like, really? Why do I have to keep dying on the first world? Alright. So, over here, grab this one up, and then... Alright, so ride this flying question mark block, and then there you go. That's your third star coin. All right. All right. So um, that's it for two four, and I think the last level we got left is the airship. But I also didn't mention this either. But um, first off, I know um, Super Smash Four or Super Smash Bros. Four already came out. Um, I'm already aware that it's out because I even checked my notifications box on my 3DS and it said that the game was supposed to be coming out October 3rd and today right now is actually October 4th and I'm recording this and World 1 on so 
Yeah. I don't have Sm Super Smash Bros. 4 yet, and the reason is because I haven't had money to get it yet, so. Uh, hopefully soon I'll have enough money to get it, but for the meantime, I I have, I haven't, I really have nothing else better to do right now. But yeah, no Smash 4, but I have been going on my 3DS friend list a lot recently, the past few weeks, and I, I've noticed a lot of people have been playing Super Smash Bros. 4 a lot lately. I mean, not that it's a bad thing. Still, I mean, originally I used to be seeing a lot of people on my friend list play Pokemon X and Y. Now everyone's playing Super Smash Bros. 4 and all that. Like, everyone I see online is basically playing Super Smash Bros. 4. Alright, so over here, grab grab the first star coin and a couple of timers. And then over here, I, okay, I'm trying to be really careful here. Uh, Alright, there you go. Alright, I remember this section. I can't see where I'm going, okay. Actually, you know what? I'm going to grab a few coins while I'm here. 50 of them. Yeah, that's right. Grab those 50 coins. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Hold on. Yeah, I remember that part. That one up. I remember that one up, though. So here we're basically battling uh, Boom Boom, who's like a really easy boss. I mean, look at that. Three hits and the guy's dead. All right, so here I'll just, let's just grab all the coins that he scattered out and then grab this timer and then. Now usually not all the time, but most of the times you probably should come over here and grab the one up. So, yep. Alright, so that's basically World 2. And I am I guess if I have enough memory, I might actually record World 3 as well. Yeah, I'm actually going to do that. Record, record three worlds in one day. That would just make things much easier if I did that, now that I think of it. Alright, so... Off we go to the next world. Yep, another letter. Alright, so just shake that. Again, it's still pretty I still find it pretty cool that you can shake the photos and all that. Like if you shake your 3DS, the photos move. Alright, see you guys in World 3.